It really is about sharing conversations. Arrow.net. A-R-R-O-E.net. All right, let's do it. Let's play it forward. These are real people. Real stories, the struggle to play it forward. Episode number 498 is with James Earl and Claire Gillies from the TV show Sprung, which can be seen on Freebie. Hey, Earl, what's up? <laughs> hey, Earl. <laughs> I'm glad you brought your energy. Oh, my God. You had to have been watching those Emmy Awards last night saying, that's us next year. Sprung is going to be up there. We're, we're going to be up there getting no, some awards. Yes. Oh, yes. You're talking my language right now. <laughs> yes. I wasn't watching the Emmys, but I'm definitely feeling it. Well, I'll tell you what, you guys deal with things that, to me, it seems like the Emmy Award winners are those that deal with everyday situations that really get into our lives. We laugh about it. There's mystery to it. There's drama. And that's exactly what Sprung is. It's something that's, hey, look, this is about us. Wow. Yeah, man, you're hitting it on the nose today. Yeah, you might be my favorite person. <laughs> <laughs> now, getting involved with Free V. Now, there, there could be listeners that don't understand what that is. So what, what is the process of, of how they can find that so they can also get wrapped in with Sprung? Yeah, so Free V is a new streaming platform. It's on all your devices, wherever you watch TV. You can download it on your Amazon, on your Fire, Fire Stick TV, wherever. But it's a new streaming platform, um, and it's amazing. And it's free. A lot of times we've been, especially with the recession we going through, I'm tired of all these subscription bills. Um, I mean, people, I had $200, $300 in subscriptions mm-hmm. last month. I had to delete so much. And to have a free app with actually amazing content is a blessing. So, yeah, shouts out to Amazon Freebie. I need everybody to download it right now. Because that's how you watch Sprung. And, and doesn't that, Claire, open up the door for actors as well, that, that it really is a new golden age for people to not only get into more binge watching, but basically to see the true actors stepping through that cloud? Yeah, totally. Totally. How has that opened up the door for you? Because, I mean, I mean, it seems like these platforms are so wide open right now for not only just the actors, but the writers, the producers, the directors, and everybody seems to be cross-pollinating in the way they're sharing their skills. Yeah, I mean, um, this is the first door I've walked through, so I'm loving it. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm it's really excited to see... Uh, where Free V goes. I hope we get another season. And um, it's like James was saying, it's just exciting to have a new platform that is free and you can access on in so many places. It's just nice to have something more accessible. And there are only like two 90 minute commercials. It's really quick and nice. And it kind of allows you to take a break, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Um, yeah. It's, it's awesome. I'm, I'm so excited to see where it goes. And it's really interesting, too, because right now we're in a time where these the big studios, you know, we got a lot of stories that need to be told. And yes. this is a specific story. This story couldn't really be told anywhere. It needed to have its own platform. So it made so much sense that we're here. Well, I would, totally. I would love to. We're the first comedy series, too. First original comedy series on Freebie. So. Oh, see, now that you take me all the way back to the days of. Uh, uh, you know, uh, of the, what, what happened with Fox, with 21 Jump Street and stuff like that, because, I mean, I love it when it starts here, because that means that we grew with you here where the seed was planted. That really inspires me now about Sprung. Yep. Yeah, yeah it's, it feels really special. It's nice, like you said, to be at the start of something, to be yeah. the first one. So now what, what kind of prep did you guys have to do in order to bring this together? Because once again, th- this, this is, this is a, a part of our lives out here in the real world. There, there are people that are getting out of prison, they, but, but nobody wants to really tell their story. And they don't want to do it in a way, I mean, they, it has to be so hardcore all the time, like 48 hours and stuff. But you guys are really making it relatable in the way that you turn the crime around. You're doing crimes for the right reason. Yep. Yeah, we're different kind of criminals. You know, it's all type of criminals out there. We we showing you about the other ones. And you can do crimes for good. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Crime for good. But with this show, um, Greg was really specific. So our prep time, you know, we did all our table reads on Zoom. All the table reads was on Zoom. Um, you know, we didn't we didn't do any like testing or nothing like that. We literally flew to Pittsburgh and we started shooting. And it was great. It was kind of like, you know, with me, I'm so used to doing all these where you would do like a screen test and camera test yep. and all these tests. And it was none of that. It was straight to work. And I loved it. 
Well, for the two of you, don't you, don't you think that this has provided a new texture? And what I mean by that is, I mean, it's, it's like even with a podcast these days. I don't have to be in these really beautiful studios. I can be at a at, at, at a Burger King with a microphone because I'm taking listeners there. NPR has been doing that since day one. Right. Yeah, 100 percent. But we still got to go on location and film these movies and TV yep. shows. Yeah, yeah we but- can we can do all the prep work anywhere. But to be on, which is awesome, by the way. We got to shoot in Pittsburgh, and I felt like, um, on the topic of prep, that kind of helps too. Just like being in a different city with a different climate, you know, that environment also helps with our character development and and the realness of like our family and where we're at. <laughs> so now, Claire, I got to ask you a question about you. You mentioned that this was the first time you've stepped through the cloud. Well, the real world is going to start recognizing your character over you. How, how are you, how are you going to handle that in front of, you know, even on social media or in person when people start calling you by your character name? Bring it on. Yeah. I am currently wearing a Wiggles necklace. I'm Wiggles number one fan. Um, so, yeah, you can't stop me. That's fine. James, the writing is unbelievable. Sometimes we don't ever talk about the writers that bring it all together. What is it like to sit down with this team? You were talking about the reads and stuff like that on Zoom, but those writers have got to do their show prep as well. Yeah, well, it wasn't a lot of writers. You got Greg Garcia who wrote it all, and he had a team of about two people and a couple of friends that – I forgot the lady's name that was one of the writers. She was there all the time. Uh, Gina? Really, Yeah, Gina. You know what I'm saying? And But he his group – is really tight. You know, when you do a lot of these TV shows, you got a writer's yep. room with like 50 people, blah, blah, blah. Greg Garcia is a really interesting, specific person. I don't think you meet too many directors that have their vision and really are confident in it. You know, a lot of times you need all these extra writers to help you hold up your ideas, but he knew this idea from front to back. He didn't really need much help. He had a small team of people that he trusted, and yeah, he, he killed it. Well, and you're part of that collaboration because now you're the voice of what comes from his imagination, and that's what's going to make this connection on Sprung such a big hit on Freebie. 100 percent i agree absolutely definitely. please come back to this show anytime in the future especially on season number 25 because i want to celebrate your 25th anniversary for sprung all right if we go to the emmys i'm taking you with us all right, i'm there it's I'm a th- deal. <laughs> be brilliant today you two okay all right see ya